I'm Saurabh Bakchi. I'm a professor uh, in the School of Electrical and Computer Engineering in the Department of Computer Science at the Purdue University. ChatGPT is this new cutting-edge AI-based chatbot that was developed by OpenAI and released to the public in December. It's this latest tool which has our technical community really jumping up and down to try to understand this, what are the pros and the cons. Simply put, it is the best AI-based chatbot known to us till date. Uh, the language model has many functions in addition to answering simple questions such as composing essays, describing art in great detail, having philosophical conversations and best of all even writing software code for you. However, I believe that this is still very far from this promised land of uh, artificial general intelligence which a big part of the technical community has been working its way toward. AGI is currently a theoretical form of AI where a machine would have an intelligence which is equivalent to that of humans. It would have a self-aware consciousness that is the ability to solve problems, learn from them and plan for the future. Chat GPT is not there, not even close. Uh, it's tightly controlled by its inventors, OpenAI, to control what it cannot do as a matter of principle. OpenAI has programmed the bot to refuse inappropriate requests, a nebulous category that appears to include no-nos like generating cybersecurity attacks. But users have found some ways around some of these guardrails, including rephrasing a request for illicit instructions uh, as a hypothetical thought experiment. So I think OpenAI has taken commendable steps to avoid the kinds of racist, sexist, offensive outputs that have plagued other chatbots in the past. But now that the genie is out of the bottle, I'm sure the arms race will start where adversaries will try to use it for generating cybersecurity attacks, ransomware attacks, including ransomware attacks. And it has already been used to generate phishing emails, which are very, very legitimate looking. But just as we as defenders have been developing defenses against automated attacks, I think we'll come up with ways to defend against specialized attacks that OpenGPT may come up with. I think we have strong defenses against polymorphic phishing attacks, and there is little to think that ChatGPT's phishing emails cannot be countered. ChatGPT can be a force multiplier for attackers. What used to take knowledgeable attackers may be days and months to craft. Now chat GPT can speed that up and can enable even less expert attackers to craft those kinds of attacks. But like most technology, I believe it can serve dual purposes. It can be used to generate these adversarial examples, these attack examples, which could be used to train our AI based systems better. Another aspect where ChatGPT can help us improve cybersecurity is on the human side of the equation. It can be used to create very legitimate, realistic training examples which could be used to train the defenders of our computing systems. This is important because currently it is tedious to create these kinds of realistic examples using which we can train our defenders. And this has led to this constant lamentation that we hear that humans are the weakest link in the security of our computing systems. With Chad GPT generated training examples, I think we can get to uh, reducing that problem somewhat.